This is Motorcycle Sport Media. We're at Motorcycle Live 2021, bringing you the latest in bikes, racing, and innovation. So let's find out what's new for 22. So welcome back to What's New for 22. We're here at CCM, the iconic British brand, bringing you their latest creations. And we're here with John. He's going to talk us through, well, what have we got here? Well, this is our new bike, which we've launched at the show. This is a special edition of the Maverick, which is one of our very popular scrambler models. And this bike is basically a tribute to the Mark Wahlberg uh, motorcycle that was in the recent film Infinity, or Infinite, should I say. It's a, a more of a retro style version of our current Maverick range. So as you can see, it's got this fantastic, um, very, very sort of beautiful, lustrous tank, which is, a, it, it looks like an aluminum tank, but it's a, a very special process, which is, uh, it's, it's hand poured onto the surface to give this authentic aluminum look, but it's a beautiful composite tank finish. It's got a dual saddle with this lovely um, quilted finish. Uh, also down below here, you can see that we've got these uh, lovely detail finishes. It looks like rolled aluminium to give that classic look. Um, it's carbon fiber again with this, uh, the liquid mercury finish, which you see on the tank. It's got nice little detail finishes, the little uh, CNC machine Spitfire caps, the, uh, the, the headlight protector, slightly more aggressive knobbly tires to give a, a rugged look to again, in keeping with the, uh, the bike that starred in the film and uh, lots of carbon, lots of CNC machine details. And uh, this is, uh, so far, it's been proving to be one of the most popular bikes in the show. If nobody's seen the film, it's out on Amazon Prime at the moment, and the, the stunt scenes are superb. Literally, our bikes did all the, the stunts themselves, apart from the bit where it jumps onto a, an aircraft wing. That was the, the only CGI bit, so uh, uh, fantastic model. Um, it's uh, a, a thousand pounds premium over the standard model, but uh, as I say, people seem to feel that uh, it's worth spending to get that real classic scrambler look. Okay, so now, James, we've come to the star of the show. I mean, we've had so much love for this bike. Um, social media's gone crazy. People are sharing the pictures of this. So many people are saying this is the star of the show, and it's, we're so proud to have it here. If you like, this is the culmination of 50 years of CCM. 71 was the year that uh, CCM was founded. And uh, the founder, Alan Clues, um, the story goes that, you know, he was a passionate motorcycle rider. He raced in scrambling trials, and he wanted to be the best. Uh, he wanted to have a BSA works bike, and they said no, so he set about building his own. But the only thing he never did was to emulate the titanium frame race bikes that they had. So as a special tribute to Alan, who sadly we, we lost a couple of years back, we wanted to build something that was worthy of, of, his, uh, of his heritage, and, uh, and this is it. So the, uh, the Heritage 71 bike, as you can see, it's got this incredibly lustrous titanium frame. When this was uh, first delivered from the, uh, from the engineers, we, we sort of compared the weight of the steel frame and, the, uh, and, and this beautiful titanium frame that you see here. And it was literally like picking up a push bike. It was so light and it, it's something like 36% lighter than the traditional steel frame, which is not a heavy item either. So that's the, uh, the kind of the centerpiece of the bike, that's the kind of star of the show. But we've also got lots of other unique details on here. So you've got Dimag race wheels, they shave off about another six kilos off the overall weight. Uh, we've got some beautiful finishes here, this lovely embossed uh, 50 year logo in this uh, unique quilted bespoke seat that you see here. It's got a, its own unique um, paint style. Um, all of the anodizing is exclusive to this bike and uh, lots of detailed touches. The original name clues competition machines that you see here. Uh, Brembo, um, four pot calipers, twin discs. Uh, we've got black line Olin suspension throughout. So. There's so much detail and attention given to this bike to, to make it truly unique. So we put it out here just to test the water and the response has been incredible. So it looks like we're gonna to have to build it. So 
Um, we've got a, already a huge waiting list of people who want this bike. Um, it's here on display, but to, to have it as a, a museum piece would be a travesty. It's got to be ridden. Our, our bikes are light anyway, as you know, you know, but this thing, this will be so incredible. The power to weight ratio with that lusty 600 cylinder engine and such a, a, a light overall weight will be a unique riding experience. Probably something like, you know, uh, an early 252 stroke bike in terms of power to weight ratio. So uh, yeah, we can't wait to get it on the road. Fantastic, well, it's stunning. Yeah, thanks James. Thank <laughs> you.